Hello kids, hope you all are doing good. Welcome back with a new story and this story is going to be everyone's favorite because it's mine. And it's about a very cute little flowers. And the name of the story is Flower Friends. The writer of the story is Cynthia Platt. Daisy lived in the woods with tall trees all around her. The trees gave her shade and sheltered her from bad weather. She had grown used to being the only flower. Hmm. But how cute he is. Sometimes the trees chatted among us themselves. Daisy liked to listen to the whispers of the leaves as the trees talked. But they were up so high and she was down so low. She could never make out what they were saying. This made Daisy feel lonely. She wished she had someone to talk to. It would be nice to have someone like her who was on the ground level. Hmm. Now he is sad. Then something unexpected happened. A chance seed blew in and it took root next to her. Daisy watched as the seed began to sprout. Hmm. Daisy wanted to be happy about the sprout, but she was filled with worries. Hmm. What if the new plant wasn't so friendly? And what if they didn't get along? Hmm. But what if the plant was friendly? What if they got along beautifully? This could be Daisy's big chance to make a friend. Daisy wished the sprout could grow faster so she could meet her neighbor. How cute they are! The big day finally arrived. The new plant bud unfolded. Poppy was brightly colored and her petals were flayed and fancy. She didn't look anything like Daisy. Daisy wasn't so sure they would get along after all. Daisy saw Poppy looking at the trees as the leaves whispered to each other. Do you know what they are saying? Poppy asked. No, Daisy replied. They are too far away. I wonder if they are talking about the squirrel and the birds, Poppy said. I wonder if they are talking about the clouds and the sun, Daisy replied. Daisy and Poppy looked at each other. They could talk about all those things together. Daisy almost whispered. It looks like they are friends now. Daisy had grown used to being the only flower of the forest. She had grown used to being alone. But now she wasn't lonely anymore. Yes, she has found a beautiful friend. This was the story. Hope you like it. Don't forget to push the subscribe button and follow us. Good night.